A nerve agent is, as the name suggests, something that affects the body's nervous system. That's the complex network of nerves and cells we have carrying messages to and from the brain and spinal cord to various parts of the body. Now, a nerve agent interrupts those messages from the brain, overstimulating the body and paralyzing the muscles. And if the breathing muscles are affected, the victim can die from asphyxiation. The side effects can be anything from twitching, spasms, heart failure and respiratory arrest. Now there are a number of ways the substance can be used to harm a victim. It's a liquid hazard so it can be turned into a gas with heat. The liquid though can also be put into a spray or on a cloth so it enters the body through the eyes or skin. Putting it into a drink or into food are also possibilities but experts say that would have a slower effect than direct skin contact. Nerve agents aren't hard to make in principle but they're so dangerous it takes training, specialised facilities and dedicated labs to safely mix the substances. And there are antidotes, including a medication called atropine, but they must be given soon after exposure to work properly and to try and minimise any further damage done to the muscles.